Today we're going over the best neighborhoods in North Richmond Hills, and these homes range in affordability with a median price between $400,000 and $800,000, with some lower priced options in the 300s. If you're looking for affordable homes in North Richmond Hills and you haven't seen it yet, check out my video on affordable homes in North Richmond Hills, which highlights the best options if you're buying on a budget here in North Richmond Hills. Many of the neighborhoods I'm highlighting in today's video will have HOAs. However, North Richmond Hills has fairly affordable HOA dues compared to some other neighborhoods in North Dallas usually because the HOAs in North Richland Hills don't offer as many amenities, such as a community pool, a fitness center, and other benefits that many HOAs in other cities in the area will offer. Only one neighborhood on this list doesn't have an HOA, but I'll be sure to mention that in the video as we go. And feel free to reach out to me if you guys need help buying or selling here in Dallas-Fort Worth, or if you just have any questions. I'm always happy to help, and all my contact information is in the description below. Now, let's go ahead and jump into these neighborhoods. So first up on our list is Iron Horse, which is a fairly large subdivision close to 820 and is situated alongside its own golf course. This development is made up of both townhomes and individual houses, so depending on what you're looking for, the prices will vary. That being said, the median priced home here in Iron Horse is just $400,000, with homes as low as $299,000 and as high as $505,000. The biggest expense here in Iron Horse is going to be the HOA dues which range from $1,500 to $2,768 annually. And this depends on whether you're in a townhome as well as which development inside of Iron Horse you're purchasing in, with the higher dues being for the townhomes. Homes in Iron Horse range from two to four bedrooms and two to three baths with a median square feet just under 2,000. Now your nearest grocery store is the Walmart Supercenter just six minutes away and you're living close to North Park, which is also just six minutes away. But you can also enjoy living alongside the Iron Horse Golf Course. For commuting, you're just a 16 minute drive from the Dallas Fort Worth Airport, 31 minutes to downtown Dallas, and only 15 minutes from downtown Fort Worth. Now, before we get to the next neighborhood, check out this five bed, four bath home listed here in the Iron Horse community for just $525,000. This home is just over 3,100 square feet and was built in 2009. It features a pool and spa combo with a covered patio in the backyard. You can find many smaller homes as well here in Iron Horse, but this is an example of a fairly large home that you can get in this community. Next up, we've got Fossil Creek, which is just across the interstate from Iron Horse and the only neighborhood on this list that doesn't have an HOA. The median priced home here in Fossil Creek is going to be $450,000 with a low of $431,000 and a high of $520,000. Most homes here are three or four bedrooms and two to three baths with 2,500 median square feet. You'll get a little bit more home here in Fossil Creek than you would in Iron Horse. Now, convenience is the highlight of Fossil Creek. Your nearest grocery store is Winco, just five minutes away, but the Walmart Supercenter is also nearby. And for shopping, you can go to the shops at Crown Point or the Northeast Mall, both of which are just a five minute drive. Commuting here in Fossil Creek is going to be pretty much the same as it is in Iron Horse, since it's just across the freeway. So if you like the area of Iron Horse, but you don't want to live in an HOA neighborhood, then Fossil Creek is a great pick. Now, third on our list is another neighborhood just west of Fossil Creek and is actually situated alongside the southern part of the Iron Horse Golf Course. HOA dues here are low at just $350 annually and they give you access to a clubhouse. The median home price here is going to be $455,000 and homes go for as low as $347,000 and as high as $625,000. The median square feet of a home here is $2,450 with homes ranging from three to four bedrooms and two to four baths. There's also a retirement community for people age 55 plus called Marotta Meadow Lakes that is right on the Iron Horse Golf Course if that interests you. And the highlight of not just Meadow Lakes but also Fossil Creek and Iron Horse is that you're just a six minutes drive from the North Hills Medical City. As before, your commute times are going to be similar to Fossil Creek and Iron Horse and I promise after this neighborhood we're going to branch out to other parts of North Richland Hills. Hometown is a master plan community with multiple subdivisions designed to suit a variety of needs. From townhome communities to quaint New England feeling streets, Hometown has something for everyone. Prices range from $375,000 to $763,000, with a median home value of $460,000. You can find a place here anywhere from two to five bedrooms and three to five baths, and the median square feet is just under 2,100. Hometown is designed to be walkable with more than 25 acres of parks, eight acres of lakes, waterfalls, and an abundance of beautiful trails. Hometown is right next to the North Richland Hills Center, which was developed by the hometown developer as a giant community center for North Richland Hills. Although I do believe that you have to pay a separate membership to get access to the North Richland Hills Center. It has all sorts of fitness activities from a family pool and splash pool area, to basketball courts, pickleball courts, a gym, 
baseball fields, tennis courts, yoga classes, personal training, a massage center, and much more. Now you're also close to the inner H2O water park, which is great to take the family to on a hot summer day. HOA dues here at Hometown are gonna be $1,720 a year for a single family home and $3,100 a year for a town home. But these prices may vary depending on which part of the community you're in. So make sure you confirm it when you're looking at a home here at Hometown. The current stage of development for Hometown has some available townhomes still being constructed, like this three bed, three bath townhome currently listed at a low price of just $375,000. And this thing is 1,882 square feet. Now for single family detached homes here at Hometown, you're gonna have to look at some pre-existing builds. And from what I've heard, Hometown is a great place to live if you like the feeling of having a close-knit community with quaint small town streets and a strong HOA. Some drawbacks of Hometown is that it doesn't have its own community pool and they have high HOA dues. For commutes, you're an 18 minute drive to the Dallas Fort Worth Airport, 36 minutes to downtown Dallas, and about 17 minutes from downtown Fort Worth. And the nearest grocery store is gonna be the Kroger, just four minutes away. Now, if you're interested in living in hometown or any of the neighborhoods on this list, please reach out to me day or night. I'm always happy to help people find their next home here in Dallas Fort Worth. Whether you need help finding a home, getting a pre-approval, or you need to list your house before you can move, I can help you make that happen. And I look forward to hearing from you. Now next up on our list, we've got two for one in Woodland Oaks and Woodland Estates, two developments right alongside each other. The higher priced homes will be in the Woodland Estates and the difference is largely around the finishes inside the homes. The median value here is $515,000 and you can get a home for as low as $384,000 and as high as $725,000. Homes in Woodlands are three to four bedrooms, two to four baths and have a median square feet of 2,450. The HOA dues are currently $450 annually which cover maintenance of common grounds. The nearest grocery store is Market Street which is 11 minutes away and as far as commuting goes, you'll have a 19 minute drive to the Dallas Fort Worth Airport, a 36 minute drive to downtown Dallas, and 21 minutes to downtown Fort Worth. Woodland Estates and Oaks is just a five minute drive from the North Richland Hills Center and a seven minute drive to the Colleyville Nature Center. Graham Ranch is a newer development in the center of North Richland Hills. Homes here were built in the early 2010s and the community has a median home value of $625,000 and a narrow price range with homes as low as $525,000 and as high as $700,000. Now the home values are justified because homes in Graham Ranch are massive. With a 3,600 median square foot, the homes in Graham Ranch are between four and six bedrooms and three to five bathrooms. HOA dues are low at just $395 annually and your nearest grocery store is the Walmart neighborhood market, which is eight minutes away. For commuting, the Dallas Fort Worth Airport is 20 minutes away Downtown Dallas is a whopping 38 minutes away, and downtown Fort Worth is a 21 minute drive. For those of you with kids, the Adventure World Playground is just four minutes away, and the Northeast Mall is only a 12 minute drive. Forest Glen is one of our last on this list, and a beautiful development that broke ground in the late 90s and continued to be developed throughout the mid 2000s. With an average home value of $650,000, the HOA dues here will fluctuate depending on which development you're in, from 160 annually up to 680 annually, and provide access to a clubhouse, a playground, and a community park, as well as trails. You can get a home for as low as $450,000 in Forest Glen, and there are homes for sale as high as $950,000. The median home is 3,160 square feet, and are three to five bedrooms and two to five baths. Now for near my grocery stores, you got a ton of options when it comes to Forest Glen, with a big shopping center nearby that has an Aldi, a Walmart, a Target, a Kroger, all in the same corner. And for commuting, you're 19 minutes away from the Dallas Fort Worth Airport, 39 minutes to downtown Dallas, and 21 minutes from downtown Fort Worth. Some nearby amenities include the Sky Creek Ranch Golf Club, which is seven minutes away, and the NRH2O Water Park, just 10 minutes away. Last up, we've got Thornbridge North, which is part of the great Thornbridge Estates. Homes in Thornbridge North are custom built and there are still new construction homes being built in this community. The median home value in Thornbridge North is $950,000 with homes as low as $825,000 and 1.2 million. The median square foot of a home here is just shy of 3,500 square feet and you'll get four or five bedrooms and three to five baths with a custom home here in Thornbridge North. HOA dues are $650 annually and they include the maintenance of a playground and a park in the community. To give you an idea of what Thornbridge North has to offer, check out this immaculate new build currently listed at $899,000. This home is just over 3,200 square feet with four bedrooms and four bathrooms and a three-car garage. 
It also features a large island and an open floor plan kitchen and living area. For commuting, Thornbridge North has great commute times, as you're just 16 minutes from the Dallas-Fort Worth Airport, 38 minutes to downtown Dallas, and 24 minutes to downtown Fort Worth. Now, if you're interested in buying here in Thornbridge North or any of these communities, please reach out to me day or night. I'd be happy to help you with your whole home buying experience. Whether you're looking to buy here in North Richland Hills or anywhere here in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, I'm here to help in any way that I can, so don't hesitate to reach out. And I hope you guys enjoyed seeing some of the best neighborhoods here in North Richland Hills, and remember to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel for more content just like this. And if you've got some time on your hands, go ahead and check out my latest video above.